everybody, Martha here, so we're back. I'm doing an extra video today because, well, the one I'm having to upload is taking a while. Let's play around on the playground <laughs> for a while. Oh. Here, I thought we are going to crawl. <sighs> See if we cloud a slide. Yay! Oh, he's too big to go on the swings. <laughs> Here. Hmm. What? This won't take long. We're going in this one too. Ready. Want to get to Sector Seven in style? This is the passageway for you. Getting home? And if I said I wasn't? I'll go with you. I thought you needed to get back. <laughs> Don't worry. I have a backup route for emergencies, and it's safer too. <laughs> Guess this is it then. Ready? Yeah. Uh oh, we need to hide. Yeah. Uh oh, or not? Tifa. Tifa. <laughs> Cloud, you're alive. I thought we'd lost you. What's going on? I'll explain everything later. But now I'm on my way to see Don Corneo. You should head back to Seventh Heaven, meet up with the gang. But... I'll be fine. You've seen how much ass I can kick? I have. You're... <laughs> you're, so, yeah. you're so pretty yeah. in that purple dress. No, you don't. You're going after her. Says who? She's a big girl. She can handle the likes of him. And worse. Yeah. Uh-uh. You don't know, Corneo. It doesn't matter how strong or smart you think you are. He'll find a way to turn it against you. And where is she going to meet him? A mansion filled with his goons. Come on. Aren't you worried what might happen in there? You have to help her. <sighs> I guess we're not gonna Come see Papa Bear again. This episode. Okay. Uh, we got Come on, Cloud. We gotta hurry. Tifa in a nice purple dress. Out. No, this ain't the part that I'm thinking it is. <laughs> no, 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 no. Waiting for this part, but <laughs> I, huh? See where she go? Hey there, girl. Earlier, do you have any idea where she went? No. And if you don't need a ride, then get the hell out of here. Can't you see I'm trying to work? Can't say I can, no. What'd you say to me, you little... What's all the ruckus out here? Hmm. I don't know you. What's your story? We're looking for a girl okay, who took one Sam of your Elliot. carriages. Can you help us find her? Depends. What do you want with this girl here? Guess. We want to save... Save her from a life without this handsome guy. Huh? So, that's how it is, huh? Well, I get a lot of customers. 
Hard to keep track of them all. This girl, what's she look like? Well... See, <laughs> she's in great shape. She's a great fighter. She looks great and handy. She's great and hand the and lean the books. <laughs> um, she's a great fighter. I'm not sure that helps. Wait a minute. You talking about Tifa? That's her. <laughs> oh, looks like someone's got a bit of a crush. Hate to break your heart, kid, but it's gonna be a long while before she sees the light of day again. What do you mean? She's a real pretty girl. Corneo's hosting another audition, and Tifa was chosen as a candidate. An audition for what? For the title of the next Mrs. Corneo. She's what he likes all rolled into one sweet package. I haven't scouted girls for so long, I know his taste better than my own. And considering those tastes, I can guarantee you this. She won't be walking out of that mansion anytime soon. If at all. So where can we find this Don Corneo? Sounds like kidnapping. What are you asking for? Thinking of raising holy hell or something? Do what you gotta, but leave me out of it. I told you what you want to know. Now take a walk. Uh, it's okay, and there goes our best lead yet. <laughs> this guy just reminds you of Sam Elliott. Maybe we'll have better luck in town. <laughs> He's a cowboy. His out. voice is steep. He has a beard. I mean, his beard is not as gray as his, but. <laughs> Welcome to Wall Market, the pleasure capital of Midgar that's got everything for everybody. Couple, huh? It's all good. Play together, do your own thing, earn a little scratch on the side even. Whatever you're into, we got you. Got a special a one time limited offer. No, thank you. Come on, Cloud. Let's go. Okay, let's be down for a sec. You two. Yes, you. Do you have a place to stay this enchanted evening? We have the perfect room for a sweet-looking couple like you. Uh, what? No thanks. But you thought about it, didn't you? <laughs> Just give me a holler when you change your mind. Hey. This place is just freaking me out every time I turn a turn. Hey there. We're a pharmacy, but we stock other stuff too. Everything except for ether, so I'm gonna get at least uh, six more. Thanks a bunch. I will go wherever my research leads me, but the success of my endeavors rests entirely upon you. Your assistance would be much appreciated. Fascinating theory. Perhaps you can lend me your assistance in gathering data to test it. Okay, let's put.
Okay. I've done it again. My apologies, sir. We are not ready to open at this time. I'm so sorry. I know why you're here. Yes, sir. This is a restaurant, if you can believe it. Hey, you hear about that real narrow street just over there? You're not still wasting your gill at the Honeybee Inn, are you? <laughs> you bet I am. Found me a secret route in, one nobody don't know about. Only trouble is, it's filled with drunks and garbage. This is easy at lost in. Uh, that sense, I can't stand it. Are you okay, sir? you think he's fine just drunk like oh. the rest of them am That's i right Cornelio has an understanding yeah. of the tree it's oh. a restaurant if you can believe it the owner uh, i can't believe i bought the same disc twice uh, excuse me sir if yes? you like you can have it Thank you. Soon, so send me off with I know she's not supposed to see any of our customers outside. Right? Oh. Warm relaxation, the sweet embrace of pretty lady. Oh, that's what I need. What the heck are you doing here, Joey? <laughs> oh, to enter or not to enter, that is the question. Wherefore does this philosophical quandary torment me? You totally get where I'm coming from, right? I knew it. Let me guess. He doesn't know After you've had your fun, you fall into a spiral of shame and self-love. <laughs> but it only lasts a moment, doesn't it? Next thing you know, you're right back here again. Huh? Got a question for me? Seen Tifa around? Tifa? My love? My light? Who are you and how do you know her? No, shut up. I don't care. Tifa's here? Why? Tell me why! Uh, oh, God, no. I'm I did this to her, didn't I? She kept looking for me to beg me not to leave her. Step out of it, Johnny. Your Tifa needs you. Tifa, I'm coming, baby. Who was that? Nobody you want or need to know. This is it. Oh, here we go. Oh, I lost him again. Oh well. Don't care. Oh, so restaurant. If you can believe it. You're... <laughs> Welcome to Wall Market's premier weapon shop.
I'm never gonna use sleep, so I'm gonna get rid of that one. Do come again. We're safe for now. They would lead to a ceasefire, apparently. Yeah. Check it out. Uh... I think we might have found our man. And he's a gaudy one. Yeah. Talk about your chi talk about your Japanese temple. I think I got everything around here. Let's go in. Even though it's never that easy, just waltz right in. Not so fast, buddy. Back it up. Got no need for pretty boys here. We're looking for someone. Let me guess. First time in Walmart, kid. Yeah? So? So people do can't just it. walk through the dung's front door. Especially men. How about me then? Can I go inside? Maybe, but you're men. But you're gonna wish you didn't. You know Leslie? She's kinda cute. Homely, but cute. Excuse you? Kinda cute's not gonna cut it. Come on, can't you help us out? Do you have any idea what you're getting yourself into? Aerith. Seriously, Les, she's not half bad. With a little work, I bet she'd clean up real nice. Cloud, requesting permission to kill. Granted. <laughs> no, you're supposed to say granted. Sure you an audition? <laughs> then you're gonna need to get official approval. And who can give us that? The trio. The only ones in town who are considered authorities on Corneo's particular tastes. First, okay. there's Chocobo Sam. And then there's Madam M him? over at the massage parlor. Last but not least, there's the Honeybee Inn's Andrea Rodea. They're an eccentric bunch, to put it mildly. And you should know they don't recommend just any girl stupid enough to come knocking. Hmm. Duly noted. Thanks for the info. We'll be back soon. Okay. Well, we already talked to Sam Elliott. I'm not calling him a chokeable Sam. He's Sam Elliott! <laughs> You don't have that nice cooming song voice and a cowboy hat and a and a beard and not be not expect to call Sam Elliot. Aerith, you sure about this? If you've got any better ideas. Not really. So that's the way it is. Hmm. Tifa's been invited into the Don's estate. Huh? But to earn such a privilege, you must first win the approval of one of the trio. Right? Meaning, yes. I now know what I must do to save her. Stay strong, Tifa. Help is on the way. Johnny's coming, Not baby. from you, though. <laughs> Not the sharpest tool in the shed, is he? No. Nope. I'm so sorry that those idiots denied you like that. Aerith, whoever says you are not that bad is a freaking idiot. Those three in there are idiots, okay? You are never not bad, okay? You are smoking. Okay? And don't never nobody tell you otherwise. <laughs> hey there. Chocobo bean popcorn here. Shaped like everybody's favorite chocobo. Get them while they're hot. Okay, this is what I thought it was, but nope, apparently not. Oh, 
Not you two again. Told you once, I'll tell you a thousand times. Got nothing for you. Now scram. Wait, hear us out. You're one of the trio, right? I want you to get me into the audition. Huh? Pretty please? Why not? Really? Sure. Next time an audition comes around, I'll put your name in that. Next time will be too late. Can't you get me into this one? You want in now? No can do, sweetheart. Hardy recommended Tifa, and she's got this in the bag. How can you be so sure Corneo will pick Tifa? You never know, he might pick me. Damn, you really do want in, don't you? Sure do. Then how's about we play for it? Call it, Missy. Heads or tails? Yes, right. And I'll grant you your wish. <sighs> oh, go, come on, I hate yes, this. Wrong, and you'll leave me in peace. <laughs> uh, um, tails. Tails. Dead. You lose. Darn! <laughs> Hey, don't look so glum. You're a pretty enough gal. Just not quite Corneo's cup of tea. You, how could you? But if only the Don will do. Try convincing one of the other two. That's why it's a trio, not just the Mio. Now skedaddle. Hey, you may sound like him, but you Wait. ain't him. I'm still gonna call Mind you that. I see that coin of yours? It's heads on both sides, isn't it? <sighs> Trick coin. I had a hunch. That's cheating! And that's the wall market way. Lesson learned. Still cheating. Yep. I should have said heads. Darn it. Now I know better. Next time I play the game, I know better. I guess they're closed right now? Try looking for another one of the trio. There's something downright wrong with this place. Why it's still here? Okay. Well, why wouldn't let me into that one? Next, we had to get uh, the other one. supposed to go down like Think this. So. Ah, Let me handle this. To see Andrea. You wait out here, okay? We will. And why would I do that? No, like... I'm coming with. I'm not really sure that... You're a man of many talents, but talking isn't one of them. Whoa. <laughs> do I even want to know where I'm at? <laughs> Good evening. Oh. 
Hiya. Welcome to the heart and soul of Wall Market, the Honey Bee Inn. Is there a honey boy or girl whose company you desire? Uh, we're here to see okay, Andrea. Okay, I know Rodea. where I'm at. Ah, be in. Now, are you the one who made the appointment, sir? Can I have your name? Oh, we don't have an appointment. I see. I'm terribly sorry, sir. An appointment is required, and the earliest available slot is three years from now. Holy cows! All we want is five minutes. He can spare that. I need his help for the Corneo audition. Yes, well, regardless of the circumstances, you cannot meet him without an appointment. Is there really no other way? It is rare, but Mr. Rodea does occasionally extend invitations to individuals who catch his eye. Otherwise, I'm sorry, but there really is nothing that can be done. I guess that's that then. Oh well, let's try someone else. But the other one was locked. the two of you step right up now then what manner of massage do you desire ah those masks so <laughs> is this your first time in our establishment mm -hmm. we are a hand massage parlor okay. an excess of fatigue and tension can make even the simplest task I a terrible don't mind this place it is our pleasure to relieve our patrons of that tension <laughs> And what better way to seek relief than through the skilled ministrations of a professional? So now that we understand each other, what manner of massage do you desire? We're not customers. Then you are... Hoping you can help us get an invite to an audition with oh, Don... Oh, love of... Say another word and I'll shove this fan right down your throat. Oh. Uh. Ugh, this is the last thing I need. You're young and stupid, and I suppose that means you think I'll let you off easy. So, you want what? A favor? Well, here's the thing. This is a massage parlor, a respectable establishment. But if you don't require our services... Then tell me! Is there any reason I shouldn't have you dragged outside and shot for wasting my valuable time? Well... Hmm... Name? Cloud? Cloud Strife. Hand. Huh? Give it to me! Okay. The strong, firm hands of a fighter. Yet they possess a certain elegance and grace. Okay, Cloud. Let's see what you're made of. After that, we'll talk. So, which okay. course will it be? I'll just do this one. Hey, you don't have enough for that. Why don't you choose a course you can actually afford? <laughs> then make your way to the room in the back. And wait. Cloud? Well then, it should go without saying that you get what you pay for. All four fingers at once, quick, and to the point. <clears throat> Little rough. Hmm? They can stop at any time if it's too much to handle. <clears throat> okay, that's one hell of a hand massage. 
Try flexing the muscles. You'll feel the difference. Hmm? Loose and limber. Am I right? Actually, yeah. Hmm. How was it? It's all right, I guess. What are you doing? Flexing. Flexing. Uh, never mind. Hm. Think you'll make a habit of it? <sighs> All right then. I think I've seen everything I need to see. So, tell me what you want, and we'll take it from there. You're one of the trio, right? I want to get into Corneo's next audition. And why in the world would you want to do that? Hmm? Okay. Really? But, you cannot go dress like that. Huh? Okay. I could never send Carneo a candidate wearing such a plain looking getup. Doing hey! so would call my position as one of the trio into question. It's not exactly my color, but. Is something hey! wrong with my outfit? It's comfortable, isn't it? Cloud the fashion critic. <laughs> Look, just take it outside the You're parlor, asking you? the wrong girl. Sorry, stop. <laughs> well, I know Cloud's a so, guy, but you know I what I mean. I'm a girl. <laughs> hmm. You just leave that to me. I'll put you in a dress so fabulous. You'll look like a million gill. So Why long as you can't dress, but okay. How much? What I said. But don't worry. It's obvious you can't afford a dress with that kind of price tag. So listen. I have an idea. What? There's an underground coliseum in this town. Up for a fight, Cloud? Good. Because I'm getting you into that arena. If you win the tournament, I'll transform Aerith into a drop-dead gorgeous beauty. Is there any prize money? <laughs> yes. For the person who got you in. So, what do you say? All right. That's what I like to hear. You'll need this. They're already letting fighters inside. You should hurry. Run along. Okay. So, we had, um, like, three different people. We had, um, Sam Elliott. Um, I don't know what to call you, because I don't know about good with those, uh, good, good as, uh, massages, but we also had, like, Bumblebee, the Bumblebee people. <laughs> I do not like the scary mask. I wouldn't expect a fair fight in this town. I think that we can win it all? Right near her. That's one thing I'm definitely sure of. Scary I appreciate Max the lady. confidence. Just food. don't get too cocky, okay? So scary Max Lady helped us. Spectators only. What's this? You're here to compete? <laughs> I hope you know you're cutting it really close. So, the two of you are a team? Team? No, it's just me. Yes, the two of us are a team. I need to get into that audition, but I won't let anyone else fight my battles for me. That includes you, mister. <sighs> All right. Okay. Team it is. Head to the waiting area down below. Down, down, down we go. 
I don't know. I wonder how many people are fighting. Does it matter? Hey, you're not nervous, are you? Nope. Hell no. Really? You're even more quiet than usual. Just trying to focus. Like you should. Hey! Lovebirds! Over here! In the city that never sleeps, in the paradise of debauchery, it's in the pain and pleasure. Where your every desire can be indulged for the right price. Oh, my To you, a steam coming through the chaos and bloodshed, we bid you the warmest of welcome. Are you sitting comfortably? Or tonight, the most gruesome spectacle anywhere in Walmart or beyond shall be yours to witness here in the Corneo Coliseum! Tonight's grand prize is no less than one million gil, and there's only one way to get it. Brutalize your opponent, thoroughly and utterly, viciously, without mercy, until they vomit blood. Only the most ruthless fighters, the savages still standing here at the end, shall claim the gil and the glory. And now, the long-awaited event in which the blessed star feet will battle for your amusement, and the Warriors of every shape and size will fight to the death before your very eyes! In tonight's Corneo Time! This place is really something. You two, wait here until it's time. Oh, <laughs> you again. Ouch, what happened to your face? I just needed a little scratch, you know. So I signed up for the preliminaries and, well, I hope you guys realize what you're getting into. I don't want to scare you, but if you can make a run for it, you should. We look cowards to you. Cloud and Aaron. Your match will begin shortly. Please make your way to the gate. Okay. We're in way too deep to back out now. I am not afraid. Okay, I don't care what he says. Not afraid. You two ready? Yep. Try not to get yourselves killed. No, don't worry. I won't. We welcome two fighters, a young couple no less. Talk about a bad day! Well, this is their first tournament, the bad first date, and most likely their last, inexperienced as they are. Or are they? Give it up for Cloud and Eric! One of Walmart's own, a renowned master of beasts. Will his friends make a meal of our two challenges before our very eyes? They've already been given their appetizers. Their hunger for flesh and fear is unquenchable. The demon dogs of hell, the Sanguine Stalkers! <laughs> You brought animals? Oh, first timers, huh? There's no rule that says you gotta fight man to man. We're in for a treat, ladies and gentlemen. Who will prevail in this brutal contest between man and beast? This could be over in an instant, so don't even blink. Without further ado, the fourth match of the first round begins now! <laughs> 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 You're 
down go team mm. what's wrong the rules don't make sense yeah true but maybe it'll be better in the next match nah wouldn't bet on it better to expect the worst And Aaron, your match will begin shortly. Please make your way to the gate. Okay. Well, usually the first match is easy. That's what they call beginner's luck. But the next match won't be so easy. Ready to rock? Just remember, try not to die. Um, um we already discussed this. I won't. For the second match in our spectacular semifinals, fresh from their first date with death, I present the Lucky Couple. We're like unlucky for the rest of us. Give it up once again for Cloud and Eric. Couple my ass! What the hell you two trying to pull? You assholes cost me a fortune. Yeah, yeah. Their opponents, screamers in this backyard, thieves and killers through and through. Too criminal for common criminals, the worst of the worst! Ladies and gentlemen, check your pockets, because they may have already robbed you blind! The most contemptible sons of bitches this side of war market, Vex Benefit! <laughs> These idiots again! Something. 
Well, of course he is. I did give him a massage, you know. His palm told quite the tale. He's cheated death more than a few times. Hmm. So have half the people in this town. Anyway, we're both still alive. Call him. <sighs> there you go again. One of these days, your luck is going to run out. When I fall from grace, maybe I'll land in your parlor once more. <clears throat> that is one mistake I will never repeat. <laughs> you gotta admit, Andy, the way he moves is totally amazing! Andy! Next up, the big finale. Yeah. I thought you'd be happier. Just thinking about what we might face next. But you know, we've made it this far. I'm sure we can handle anything they throw at us. Okay. So I'm going to rest up a little bit, then I'll end the video, guys. So see you guys later. So I'll have the last fight next time. So bye-bye.